That will be a very different call in the coming years. In a vote that was open to more than 82,000 people this week, one of these five will be voted UND's new nickname, leaving Fighting Sioux in the past. It's been a long process, and you know we know the Fighting Sioux is not coming back, and I think people are finally starting to grasp that. I've never seen a nickname or logo have so much so much power to so many people. You know, when the NCAA comes down like that, you know, you, you have to make those changes, which is really, really hard. Voting closed Friday at midnight, and while some may never truly part with the Fighting Sioux logo, UND could have a new nickname as soon as Monday. There's going to be people that are okay with it. There's going to be people that aren't okay with it. And, uh, and the way it is now, more people are going to complain about it than they're going to say, hey, this is a good thing. Hopefully long term, there's, you know, emotions settle down and the university can move forward in a positive direction. Whatever it is, I hope that people still, you know, take pride in the university and still support the university because I'll tell you what, that place has done a lot for a lot of people and, and I hope that they continue to support uh, UND. So while some are concrete on their choice of UND's new nickname. I did vote, yeah, yeah, I did vote and, uh, and Nodax was my choice. I'm from North Dakota. I love North Dakota. I came back and played here as a student athlete and if I'm going to go put a jersey on again for North Dakota, it'd be a Nodak. Others will debate up until the last second. When I do, I've got three choices going around in my head, and I guess I'll just do the hover mouse thing and whatever it lands up on, then I'll click and I'll be done with it. While some won't even take part. I don't plan on participating. I uh, Unfortunately, like I said, I'm, I played through that era. Uh, I used to get the uh, UND hockey games on TV as a child, and we watched those games. And um, to me, like I said, it'll, it'll always be the same. Reporting for Sports Sunday, I'm Phil Newman.